Well, I just wanted to say um, a very very belated and happy uh, Remembrance Day and a very, very special Remembrance Day message from me. 11th of November, every single year, is a very important day to our calendar. It is known as Remembrance Day, the day, the very day to remember our soldiers who had died while fighting for our freedom in all wars. Memorial services are held everywhere of the 11th hour of the 11th day of the 11th month. We do have many World War II veterans who are still alive. Some have survived and are alive as of today in 2020 and 2021, but many, as you know, and not surprisingly, have died. It's a sad day, and we always have um, the, the minute silence uh, on the very day of Remembrance Day, and uh, Remembran Remembrance Sunday is when we have the uh, special memorial service, which couldn't be done very properly this year, but um, hopefully next year or two will be... Um, the full memorial service, dedicating the memoriam of um, the soldiers who uh, fought for our freedom in World War One and World War Two. Yes, and even if there are many of you who are very, very cynical about um, about this and don't care about the fallen or things, you please, you really must remember that uh, Remembrance Day is not about over-glorifying war. It's about the conflict which we've suffered through, a reminder of why we must never have a world war again. It's also a time to, re to reflect the soldiers who have passed away as well, who had fought for our freedom, as a blunt message. Yes, but I can't say how fortunate I am for them, for our government and several other governments, um, really, to have like Veterans Day and our government to have Remembrance Day in honour of our in the bravery and courage of our war veterans, in a way. So, it's a fortunate event, but can be very, very sad, understandably, and it does happen. Thanks for listening to my message, everybody, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye, everybody. From your friend, Foxy.